hi and welcome or welcome back to the channel. Today's video is, yes you guessed it, uh, quite a large diamond art club unboxing haul. <laughs> Goodness gracious ridiculousness. So I have all these to get through so we'll get started. I'm just going to start unboxing. I will show you uh, what I got in my little kits and which canvases I got. So excited. Let's get into it. So the first item I have to show you from Diamond Art Club is the Wicked Witch. I'm really excited for this one. This is my second Ennis Guerrero canvas from Diamond Art Club. It's a round and it is 20 inches by 28 or 51 centimetres by 71. Um, and I'm going to open this up. I will show you the the kit and the drills and then I will move to the floor to show you the canvases of these because otherwise I just I, I can't show them properly because we're too close for the size of these canvases uh, let's pull out the kit so you get your little sticker for the top of your box your tool kit these are these are exciting. I love the toolkits with their um, washi and cover minders in. Bear with me. Peel this bad boy open. I also really like their little trays, to be honest. I am slowly um, transferring all the ones from my uh, tray tower to uh, the Diamond Art Club version. So, in your kits, you're going to get a little diamond painting tray with stopper set of baggies, a thin set of places in a four placer and a seven. I use these seven ones all the time and I really appreciate getting those. A little box of wax with two heart shaped wax patties in their cute little case. We got a dark blue pen and a dark blue squishy this time. Ignore the noise. There we go. This is a comfort grip so that you can you comfortably use these. I will not be spending as much time on the kits after this first one. And then you get your fun little cover minder, which is, of course, a little magnet for holding back your plastic or keeping your canvas covered. And this looks to be, I'd have said strawberry, except for the edging to it. Is it a pie? <laughs> I'm not sure. Maybe it's a tart. Very cute though. Uh, that is that. And then you also get your washi and my roll. And you get plenty on this. Enough to actually be able to rim your canvas in one roll. And this one is a really pretty pale green with red roses. These are always random. So that is that. We will open up our sealed bag and try and just pull open the top. And we'll do the drills and then like I say I will show you the picture in full in a moment so you get your little information sheet oh my stickers have taken a bit of a bashing in here luckily it's only the spares that have popped free it's just the way they've been put into the bag so i'm just gonna peel all these spares off before they start sticking to my uh, actual the ones I'm going to use. So let's get rid of all these little tabs. There we go. So yeah, the only ones that have come off are the blank spares that they also send. So we have the Wicked Witch. Beautifully dark. I'm really excited for this. And we have... 27 colours for this canvas, no special drills and I'm going to pause you and just open my drill bag. 
um, and you will see we've got lots of black, very pinky mauvey brown tone colours, blue greys, beautiful kind of warm grey, very deep browns, a little bit of a purple grey, couple of colours, not many in there, more brown, more grey, more taupe, pinky mauves and more black, very much my kind of canvas it would say uh, a little bit of cream so this one's going to be a very dark color scheme hope you guys can see that properly i'm just going to we're going to do that a little bit there we go and you can see all those fun colours and then this beautiful canvas in all her glory like I say you've got to be able to appreciate a little bit of dark art <laughs> she is my Halloween entry and uh, I am super excited for her she's looking pretty big now <laughs> I'm hoping I can get her finished in time but yeah so i'm just gonna gonna lift her right up and uh show you how beautifully clear this drill field is don't think there'll be any problem Really nice symbols there. Even a little bit of colour colour blocking. So we've got quite a bit of black uh, colour blocking, which is nice. Some of this L in here. A um, little bit in the skin as we come up. Lots of black rows. Some of this U and these fives. Lots in this black hat. That'll go so nice and quickly. I'll uh, really help it pass the time a little bit better. Refocus you. And that is her. So I'm going to go on to the next one. Bear with me. Okay, so the second canvas I got, and I've changed my, <laughs> I've changed the way I'm doing this. We're going to do it on the floor so that um, you guys can see properly what's going on. So canvas number two is this beautiful piece and she is Red Riding Hood by Sandra Winter. She's a round drill and she's 22 inches by 28 or 56 centimetres by 71. She's got 36 colours and four, five, five of those colours are AB drills. And I just loved this really beautiful, really dark um, red riding hood. She actually turns into this beautiful lady. I can never see my own camera. There we go. And uh, this beautiful piece. So I'm really excited. Um, obviously, colour wise, I'm sorry, guys, you can see my feet. <laughs> I try not to do that. A lot of reds, we've got so a little bit of green and blue, a lot of black. I think there'll be quite a bit of colour blocking on this canvas, so it might go nice and swift. But just lots of really pretty red, pink, deep brown, and a bit of purple, and of course those AV colours. Um, from there, obviously I won't show you, the kits are the same, but I will show you... Um, Let's be honest, the couple of things in each kit that we're actually interested in and um, the only things that change and that is Cover Minder, I got another one of these, I have two of these now uh, The washi in this one is this cute pink flowers and I got a yellow glitter pen with a yellow grip here this time um, I've learnt my lesson, <laughs> you need to push these on don't pull them they will rip otherwise so that is 
that canvas. The next one, um, and I'm just going to pull them out as I go and show you guys. Um, the next one I got, I'll try and be quiet about the noise, is Moonlight. Oh, these bags take a bit of effort, to be honest. Uh, so, canvas number three. this this gorgeous beauty um right away with drill there and she will become this beautiful piece absolutely stunning um she is by chris ortega a, a round diamond painting again 20 inches by 30 or 51 centimetres by 76. We've got 22 colours, and out of that, two colours are special drills. Um, this one obviously is a lot lighter. We've got a lot of uh, pinks, purples, some, uh, some white ABs there, some deep blues, uh, a really, really dark blue. Uh, I'm not actually seeing, I think there's a tiny bit of black. So I'm really rather excited for her. She's a little bit more of a, a paler colour than I've gone for before. A little bit more pastel. Um, and then from the... Oh, no, nearly forgot to show you. I promised to show you these kits, didn't I? And I nearly forgot. Let's see. So for this one, I got... This... <laughs> this really cute uh, bunny cover minder let's uh let's refocus on him how cute um and i really like this washer this is a uh, birthday cakes and cupcakes and uh, i got a green pen and squishy this time uh, so what we are number four <laughs> number four is let's see now it's almost a surprise to me ah yes 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 here we go number four is this beautiful piece i hope you can see that there but i will show you the um picture itself this is a muted sound by you may art and we look like this beautiful really really beautiful um and of course this one is a round diamond shape uh, 20 by 26 inches or 50.7 by 65.8 in centimetres with 41 colours and out of that I do believe there are four special drill colours uh, and again this is just super fun super bright super pastel -y, and kind of really shows that uh, with all the purples and blues and uh, pinks in there it would seem I do err uh, towards a purple canvas more than I thought I would actually and then of course the beautiful pieces that I got in this one we've got a blue pen this kind of really pretty kind of just patterned washi and then this cover minder which is if my camera will show you um, almost like a little plant pot with roses in love this one super cute uh, that is that one right we're nearly there guys couple more couple more couple more oops move them out of the way but you should see the mess <laughs> in this room right now there is stuff everywhere i think i just dropped this is a square so i got tweezers um is the only difference to the kit 
Um, and this one I'm rather excited about. I saved my squares to last. So I also got... <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm trying to keep... Um, this beautiful piece, which is dun, 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 Underwater Train by Mrs. Butter D. And that is this beautiful piece. So this one's a square drill. 17.7 by 24.7 inches or 45.1 by 62.7 centimetres. We've got 51 colours this time. Um, and we seem to have three fairy dust drills and one AB drill, which is kind of super fun because I haven't worked with the fairy dust before. So you can see this is super pale. Yeah, really pale pinks, mint greens, we've got some purple. Don't think there's actually any black at all in this canvas. And this one is square, so... Yeah, I've taken the plunge, got something a little bit more difficult, I've done it, I was trying to avoid it, uh, avoid the squares for a little while just to um, ease myself in, but I saw a couple and I really wanted them, so it's happened. Um, the bits and pieces of kit this time I got with that one, obviously the tweezers because it's a square drill, uh, a pale blue pen, this cute little, um, almost like a Mario flower is what it reminds me of, um, and this kind of beautiful purple with the red flowers for washi tape, so that is that one, <laughs> dump that with all the rest of the stuff on my desk now. And then last one, and last but not least, we have, uh, I'm going to, we're going to refocus, and we're going to open this bag. And yes, this is the crazy other piece that I got. So this canvas is Jelly Space by Dakota Detwala and this creates this beautiful piece. Just crazy. And this one is a square canvas, 22 inches by 28 or 55.8 by 70.7 centimeters. We've got 61 colors in this beautiful piece. One of those is a fairy dust colour and three of those are ABs. Um, super excited and a bit nervous for this one because the actual size on this is, uh, as you can see, pretty big. Pretty, pretty big. Um, and then all of these beautiful colours. Really deep purple. Oh, just wow. Brown, green, blue. Some fairy dust white in there, couple of bags. Uh, not fairy dust there, AB, sorry, AB white in there, couple of bags. Got some very, very pale purple. I think a fair, an AB yellow. I'm not seeing the fairy dust ones. They must be hidden in the middle in there somewhere. But I think. The canvases I got are going to be absolute stunners. And with that one, I of course got tweezers again because it's a square kit. I got this really pretty washi tape. Um, I got a dark blue pen this time. And I'm just trying to locate my cover under. There it is, stuck to my tweezers. I got this beautiful kind of a, a sage green rose this is my favorite i love the rose ones i've got a white one of these and now a really pretty sage green so yeah guys um that happened 
got a few new kits, not gonna lie. Um, went a little bit crazy. I'm super excited about everything I got. Um, three of these were purchased for me by my husband for my uh, 13th wedding anniversary. So I didn't go out and go crazy and buy all these myself, but um, I will be honest, obviously. The other three purchases were me. So six stunning new diamond paintings that I am very, very pleased to add to my stash. I hope this was interesting, guys. Any questions, pop them in the comment below. If you're enjoying the videos, please do like the video and subscribe to the channel for future content. And I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.